Okay, so today we're going to be making our 3D sculptures um, with our lines today. So I'm going to show you a couple tricks on how to do that. The first thing you're going to need is a piece of paper and then you're going to need your um, paper strips and a glue stick. And so what you're going to do is there's a few different tricks on folding papers. First thing that you can do is you could just fold right here in the middle and you pinch the crease and fold it and then it looks like this. But when you go to put it on the paper, it doesn't really stay. It stays a little bit like this. But to make it really work and stay, we're going to give your paper feet. So to do that, you're going to fold out like this. There's one foot and then you do it on the other side and now it's got feet. And so what you'll do is you're going to take your glue stick and you twist it up. Remember not to twist it too far because then it breaks off. You just want to twist just enough like that. And you're going to put just a little bit of glue, not much, it doesn't need a lot, on the bottom of the feet and stick it anywhere you'd like. So, blah, like that. And if you don't want it and you want it longer, you can make it longer or skinnier by having it close. That's a nice thing. And you're just going to push down for a few seconds, one, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four. And there's our first line on our sculpture. The next one, oh, I could take a piece of paper. And I've seen some friends who go, Miss Holland, can I do a circle? Sure, it could be a roller coaster that you're having, you know, something going together. So you can make a line, make a circle. And you can glue this together and hold it. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four. And so once that's together, put a tiny bit of glue here and stick it where you'd want it to go. So maybe I want it here. One, one thousand, two, one thousand, three, one thousand, four. So there's that one. And then you can kind of keep playing. Maybe you want to have a bridge going off of this or you want to have one that's a circle or a wave like this one where you don't bend it so you could play with it that way you could also do what is called this cool folding that you accordion so you fold a little bit forward towards you and then you fold it away from you fold towards you then away from you it's towards you and then you take it and all I'm doing is I'm pinching it and I'm folding it backwards and pinch and then I fold it forwards and pinch and fold backwards and pinch and forwards and pinch and backwards and pinch and now you get this cool zigzag accordion and it already has feet for you so I could have it like this. And what's cool is what we're making can be anything. Maybe this is your amusement park that you're building. Maybe this is your favorite, uh, a dog run. Maybe you have a dog at home and you're gonna have your dog go across this crazy bridge and then your dog is going to go up and slide down and leap through the ring. There's so many really neat things that you can do. So I would like you to take your time and you're going to just keep decorating until you make your own little amusement park um, for the end of class here. Use as many colors as you want and try to make lots of different shapes. 